they're calling it the new Vietnam and da 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 da. Yeah, but can, can we afford, can this country afford another Vietnam? I support a Bush on personal grounds. I think that the world right now is such a dangerous place. Iraq was an evil man. There are a lot more evil men around, so was Saddam, and uh, they had to be taken out. The, the cultures of countries are so different. They're violent. They are violent. People say that they hate us. The Muslim society yeah. and the Christian society yeah. have been at odds for the past, what, 3,000 years, 2,000 years? Well, Islam has only existed for like 1,300 years, so... Okay. I don't think the conflict with the Islam nation will ever end whatsoever. Whether it be in Iraq, Jordan, Syria, wherever. I won't take the battle to that. I think wherever there are states that are supporting terrorists and harboring terrorists... We Germany. Be... There were a lot of people in Germany, though. I don't know if we can go into Germany. Here it says, uh, I volunteer to send my children to fight for the wars. If I had children, I don't know that I would sacrifice would want to sacrifice one of my children. This woman, she didn't want to fill out the pledge right away because she doesn't think that she agrees with all the platforms of the Bush administration, but she's going to vote for him as a protest. It's a protest vote for Bush. I'm protesting because I don't understand, like, this entire, this such hatred for him. And they're all calling him a liar because, you know, there weren't weapons of mass destruction, just weapons of mass. Destruction. Why do you think uh, no no other countries basically except England supported it? No, no, I think no, I think that uh, a lot of other countries have supported. Uh, among them, Russia, like, like Spain. Russia like, didn't support us in this war. It didn't. No, Russia and Germany and France were dead set against this war, including Russia. Putin did not want us to go to war. Yeah, because you see, uh, it's <laughs> you're putting me into the political aspect. Well, we're talking about oil economies, right? Now. That's what we're talking. We're talking about oil, right? Right. So, what, what what do you think the solution to it is? If it's a problem, I mean, is it a problem? Or How can it? Well, we spend. They, you spend billions and billions and billions of dollars in the oil industry, but we don't spend any money trying to find other fuel sources. Right. Try to find anything else to power our cars off. Right. I mean, listen to this like super diesel thing over here. It sounds like you're against the war. Oh uh, no, I'm not. There are 14 new permanent military bases in Iraq, right? You know, you sound like uh, Bush has some conspiracy to have 14 permanent bases. That's true, though. In Iraq, we've created a number of terrorists, according to Rumsfeld. Is it okay to... to... Well, I mean, we create a lot of terrorists, but if we create terrorists and they're all over there, that's better than creating terrorists and have them come over here.